Hello and welcome everyone back to the powder toy and we've got a brilliant submarine here. Does anyone in chat know what we're going to do to this brilliant submarine? Do you have any guesses? Is there anything that you would expect us to do to a submarine in the powder toy? I'd, I'd like you to uh, place, place your bets. Blow up? Ha, ah, kaboom. You guys know me well. <laughs> Let's go ahead and try to breach the submarine using extremely hot nuclear soap. Um, <laughs> yes, nuclear soap. Unfortunately, because I accidentally deleted my mod, it's going to be a while before I have that stuff again because I need to reprogram it. But the good old soap and uh, plutonium mix, you know, it'll work. It'll be fine. All right. Careful. The, gov the government will be watching if they know that you know about the soap, the soap secret. Oh, look at the soap slingshot. Holy. Go okay, wait, 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 wait. I need to. I need to redo that frame by frame because that went so quickly and was so effective. All right. So the plutonium goes super critical, and look at the soap get flung out. <laughs> Look at this stringy- look! Watch as the soap impacts. Just- uh, Oh! Oh! It broke right through the top observation deck. And uh, the mech that they had is now, well, not too happy, is it? The rest of the superheated soap is hitting the surface, and uh, there is quite a bit of damage being done. Um, it caused the water on the surface of the ocean to kind of all fly up, but now it's coming back down in a big wave. We'll go ahead and get rid of the steam, because we don't need that lag, and we'll, uh, we'll go ahead and refill the ocean a little bit, because the ocean has a somewhat unlimited amount of water in it. And it looks like our first strike was pretty, pretty successful, by, by my standards. Um, we managed to breach and get rid of one of their major weapons. So now what do we do? What kind of weapon are we going to use now? Hmm. Now, I would say if we had my mod that Nehonium would be really good for this. Um, it would kind of just melt directly through. But I think that since we don't have that, I'm going to go for an exotic bomb. Uh, I think if we go ahead and make a small exotic bomb over here. I think we can do some real damage. Alright. Here she goes. Here she goes. Gonna get a little exotic in here. All right, the, the colors and brightness means it's working and is completely safe. And the leaking means that it's it's done and it's at very hot, very hot temperatures. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Oh, huh, well that was anticlimactic. I, I was expecting a little bit more. Okay, the rainbow assault did not work very well. Hmm. All right, we're going to need alternative methods. All we've done is gotten like rainbow all over the place. Hmm. The, the ocean is freaking out a little bit, which is nice. Good job, ocean. Um, let's go ahead. I think I think we have to use something a little bit more violent. Um, let's go ahead and use a thermite capsule. I think that with all the water, heat is going to be our best bet. Let's go ahead and fill this with thermite, put a little bit of soap in to get that napalm effect, and uh, let's go ahead and grab some fire! <laughs> Three, two, one, boom! Alright, so now we have our thermite molten soap mix impacting the ocean. The issue is that it's turning into steam, and the steam is actually causing pressure, which is keeping it away. Ah, oh, we're having so much trouble getting into this submarine. If that's not going to work, 
then then we need we need something stronger darn it what we really need is something with enough pressure to oh oh i know what we could use there's something that is extremely effective i'm not going to go too far with it though because it's a little bit op <laughs> But if we get Deuterium, and we get our friend Protons, I'm pretty sure I can, uh... Oh. Yes, Protons will just pass through water. So all we need is a layer of insulation around that. Todoroki, where is Midoriya? <laughs> Darn it, guys. Come on, let's keep it to one fictional universe at a time. The Vuperian Navy really needs to, uh... Oh, what is going on? Did some, like, defense system just turn on? What? What is this? Why is there electric going through everything? What Has this always been... Oh, what happened? I didn't even mean to set that off. Oh, wow. Okay. That certainly had an effect. Wow, I didn't even mean to set it off. A stray proton hit it. Oh boy, okay, um, it looks like the attack was somewhat effective. I mean, we stripped the ocean away, but we only have like a minute before the water rushes back in again. So quickly, let's hit them with a thermite charge. Actually, let's put the ocean down first so that it'll dramatically fall in as the thermite charge goes off. This is going to be awesome. All right. Fire the thermite cannon, please. Thanks. Someone? Is anyone watching? Oh, wait. Who, who's firing the thermite? Let me know in chat. Are, are you? Who, who, whose job is it? Oh, is it gonna hit before the water? Oh, is it gonna hit before the water? No, the water's gonna hit first. We were too late. Wait, but it's so close. It's so close. It's so close. It's so close. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Breach, 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 breach. There's so much heat. There's so much heat in that one spot. Oh! All we managed to do was just get a hot piece of metal on top of it. Highly disappointing. Man, ah. Oh. We're gonna, we're gonna have to do, we're gonna have to do better. Jeez, there's like this massive, ah. Oh. Why is the water freezing down here? What is going on? Okay, I'm slightly confused about that. I won't lie. <laughs> um, hmm. All right, we need to. Hmm. That's it. We're gonna we're gonna napalm this sucker. <laughs> we're going all out. I'm tired of losing. The Vuperian military does not lose. Oh shoot! The napalm did not get set off. Like oh, maybe it did. Ooh, E, we've breached, we've breached the submarine. <laughs> that was, that was a lot of thermite, so I was kind of hoping it would breach. Um, well, it breached the entire submarine, even with the ocean filling back in. That is the question. All right, the ocean's coming back, boys. Uh, we did not take out the entire thing, but uh, I'd like to say that at this point it is pretty un non-functional. So restarting, I wonder, I wonder if we could do a like directed strike, right? What if we want to just like breach without destroying the entire ocean? We don't want to kill the animals, right, and the plants. So I'm going to design a cannon. A cannon to be used to attempt to attempt to do this. I I'm gonna make it really simple too. I think I can get a pretty simple cannon design. I think if we just use plasma and just fire it, just a plasma cannon. <laughs> um, we'll see if a plasma cannon can do it. Plasma cannon fire! Uh oh. 
or having tr okay come on 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 you can do it you can do it you can do it you can do it okay we're doing some damage to the ocean but not a ton yet come on plasma cannon <laughs> try harder yes okay plasma cannons versus submarines this is what you come to this channel for <laughs> channel channel i can speak okay come on come on come on come on uh-oh my my cannon is breaking itself it's okay just take your time just breach darn it breach <laughs> It's, it's actually having quite a bit of trouble. I think I should have aimed it further down. There we go. Come on! Yes! 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 Okay, it's pretty much breached at this point. I mean, the damage to the environment is far less than the last time around. So, it's at least better. It's gonna breach any moment now. Any moment now. I should really just design a torpedo. Yes! Okay, we've breached. We can turn it off now. <laughs> they're, they're like, what the heck was that? Alright, so now that we've uh, we've done what I was planning on doing, generally, uh, we should be able to just put the water back and watch as it floods, because we we have flooded it. We have flooded it. Oh wow, it's so hot. It's filling it with steam. It's getting steam. Oh wow, superheated steam flying in and hitting everyone inside of the submarine. That's unfortunate. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I feel like the most efficient way to do this would just be with the more destructive bomb. Even though more destructive bomb is kind of cheaty, it uh, it's really good for breaching. Not as good as Nahonium, of course, but... See, it can cheat. It can go through layers. There's no stopping it. There's no stopping more destructive bomb. It's angry. Just like me. Ah! Okay, brilliant. Good, good work, team. <laughs> we managed to destroy... <laughs> A submarine. I'm so proud of us. <laughs> Never could have thought of this. Never, ever could have come up with a way to do this. So exciting.